Greetings. Shahar Nama Jabbapur is a wonderful new book for me. It is about the life, times, and people in the town of Jabbapur in central India. Written in Hindi by Dinesh Chowdhury, it has been well translated by Lakshmi Kant Sharma for us English speakers. I'm a librarian at the University of Virginia in Charlottesville, Virginia. I wrote the foreword for Chowdhury's book. Reading the book makes me a bit nostalgic about my childhood days in Devil Forum, where my parents, James and Ruth McEldowney, lived and worked. I was born in Nagpur in the early 1940s and went to Woodstock School in Missouri in the 1950s. I spent my childhood days during the winter time of the school vacation. I'm going to talk about two things. First, Jabalpur, the town itself, and then James Murthy, one of the subjects of this book. Jabalpur is an amazing town surrounded by exciting places such as Betagat or Marble Rocks and Madhumahal. It is a rail center with vibrant commerce and a learning center with universities such as Durgavati and the college where my father was a professor, Leonard Theological College. I remember boating at Marble Rocks and picnicking there. Dinesh Chowdhury writes about the history of these places and the people and leaders who contributed to the political, social, and arts of the town. One of the book's personalities was James Sundar Murthy in chapter six, whom I knew personally. He was an amazing photographer of the area whom Dinesh further writes about and extends my understanding of him in the town and the world. Particularly notable is Murthy's photos and articles on the 1997 earthquake near Jabalpur. I think you will enjoy reading Dinesh Chowdhury's wonderful book, Shahar Namra, Jabalpur. We look forward to other similar books in the future. If you have never been to Jabalpur, you should plan to visit the town and enjoy all of its sights and people.